Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to talk about aerial roots and nodes. So let us begin. I've taken a cutting of very easily available plant called money plant to explain about nodes and aerial roots. So what is an aerial root? This bulged out structure right here that you see is known as an aerial root. Okay. Now what is a node? A node is the site of maximum cellular activity. What do I mean by that? I mean that node is the site from where a new leaf grows, from where your aerial roots grow, from where the buds grow. Node is the site from where when you propagate a cutting, the new roots develop. So node is a very important site basically. So there's a misconception that I've come across. Most people think that we can propagate only those plants using stem cuttings which have aerial roots, which is not true. We can propagate many more plants using stem cuttings which do not have aerial roots. I have done this n number of times. So here I have taken a cutting to explain you better. This is a cutting of baby sun rose. This does not have any aerial roots if you see. Okay, so what do we do to take a cutting? We take a cutting which is around four to five inches in length and we remove all the leaves below. And also we ensure that we leave some of the leaves at the top. Now, why am I leaving these leaves at the top? Because these leaves will help your cutting to sustain. And why did I remove all the leaves below? Because at the moment, your cutting needs a lot of energy in root development. Now these extra leaves which are present, which are not required, will consume a lot of energy from your stem. So it's always advised while taking a cutting for propagation, do not forget to remove the extra leaves. So now if someone asks you that can we propagate plants which do not have aerial roots using stem cuttings, please tell them that yes, it is possible. You can make many more plants from one plant that you have in your house. You can distribute it to your neighbors, your friends and make this planet a very beautiful and green place to live.